Good morning. It is the start of the vlog and this week's going to be a very chill week. I'm actually homebound. You guys can fill in the blanks, but I'm homebound this week. And so it's going to be a very, very chill week doing the best I can with whatever I got. You're going to see a lot of different things in this video. Um, we're going to talk about the nubs first and foremost and how I get rid of those because I can't make a nail appointment for the next couple of days, so I had to get these things off of my hands. And I'm actually very happy I did because you don't realize how much damage your nails take on from using whether it's next gen or gel or all these different nail applications. My nails are happy to breathe right now, so I'm happy I got these off. Um, I did a little bubble braid moment for myself today. I have not been doing makeup for the past couple of days and honestly my hair's just been like whatever and I'm like even though you're working from home today you need to spice it up a little bit you need to look a little bit more alive so I ordered some rubber bands from Amazon they came in and now we're living for the bubble braids and I'm actually happy I got them because I really like this hairstyle and I want to do it a little bit more but you need clear elastics to do that so in this vlog, like I said, it's going to be a little bit all over the place and I'm just going to narrate today. All of these clips you see are from over the weekend, but today's Monday and today's the day that we upload the video. So I figured you guys need to get some narration going too, but I'm actually going to start my work day. I'm starting on two different practices this week. I'm going to, going to be using the Ivy Lee method and Parkinson's law to really stay focused and on task. I want to be a high performer. I want to be someone who does all the different things and, you know, is able to maximize their time and I'm not there yet. So I'm hoping that with this new mindset and this new like way of working, I will find more pockets of time for me to do everything that I need to do. Um, and I did watch two podcasts or I listened to two podcasts that kind of explain both concepts. So I will link those in the description down below. If you guys are interested in either of those methods, start with the podcast, listen to the podcast first, and then it'll kind of help you understand what you need to do to get started to practice this this week. So that's where we're at. Let's make it a good Monday. I'm having coffee. I haven't had coffee for the past couple days. It's coffee time. Cheers. And this place is a mess too. Everything is just a mess. It's Christmas week though, so nothing can go bad because it's Christmas week. Coconut oil has been hard to source, so I am so excited to finally have some and I'm going to do my oil pulling right now. I do have a video talking about my oil pulling routine, which I've been very off in a while, so excited to get back into it. But yeah, check out that video on how you can use coconut oil for a healthier body and whiter teeth. Where she hangs out on the porch, oh, and just begs to be let out under supervision. That's the only time she's allowed to go outside is if I supervise her because the cat's crazy. This is what happened to the Gel X. Remember, I did a video as to what I think about it. Both of my thumbs popped off. You guys saw this in the last vlog. And then I decided to cut my nails super short so that at least it wouldn't look too crazy. And now I ordered some acetone from Amazon. Thank goodness for easy shipping. And I was honestly thinking it was gonna get here on Tuesday. So now I can sit here and soak, which is gonna be so annoying. Like, come on. I can't believe my nails cost so much money and this is how they've ended up. First of all, my voice. Secondly, it's just so funny. I'm removing glitter nail polish. So I guess I was ahead of the times in terms of what I'm doing now. Um, that was June 4th, 2011. So I still have that video up. I just. I love glitter nail polish. And I know my head's cut out, but this is because it's a nail tutorial. But. <laughs> all right, I'll let you guys go with that one. What we have here is a fresh scratch Italian <laughs> dinner. 
handmade. I'm sure other creators can relate to the fact that I'm editing this footage and there's either always going to be something out of focus, luckily that's not really my case for this specific video, or I am covering the microphone on this camera. All right. I have the Canon um, G7X, yeah, G7X, you guys just saw what that room looks like. We are working on it, okay? I have the Canon G7X, mm, I don't love it, I don't love it, it's annoying to me, I don't know what it is, I really enjoyed my Sony A5100, didn't really give me a ton of problems other than the fact that it eventually kind of stopped working on me, but... This camera just is not my favorite, and I spent a good chunk of money on it, and I know so many people love it, but it just, like, doesn't do it for me. I need to take it to a camera shop and get um, my quality figured out or, like, my settings figured out because it only allows me to upload up to, like, 720 HD, which this camera has 1080 capabilities, so very frustrating, but... Like I said, this is kind of just a boring vlog, but that's okay. We're sticking to Vlogmas. This is the last week of Vlogmas, and this one will be super exciting because, like I said, it's Christmas, and there's a ton more stuff going on, and I will be healthy by Christmas, which is a great sign. It is great news to know that I will actually be able to be around people by Christmas. So until then, we are just doing work. We are chilling. We are staying inside getting some sun as much as I can, staying healthy, going on walks, and doing the dang thing. So, hope you enjoyed this vlog nonetheless. Let me, knew, know you, let me know that you did by commenting down below, and I'll see you for week four of Vlogmas in my next upload. Bye! Mwah.